welcome to FAC 1502. Washington Duma speaking here. I'm one of the lecturers from, from Noble Tutors. Okay, guys, so we are here. Financial accounting concept principles and procedures. FAC 1502. This is this is a bit of a challenging module for, for the first year for those who are just starting with accounting. So you need to pay. Uh, a lot of attention to this one as compared to FSC 1501 uh, this is a bit a bit challenging so guys you need to to pay attention and for those who will be with us uh, you need to to ask as many questions uh, as you can you need to tackle as many questions papers as you can right so that you make it for the for the exam there are a lot of topics in this in this module but in if we are going to an exam center, uh, probably three of them or four of them will be examined. So you need to know everything because you don't know which topics are going to be examined. Okay. So after this introduction video that I'm just going to, to show you right now, I'll be in each and every topic. Uh, we're going to have a video that is covering all, 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 all the concepts that you need for, for that topic. And we're also going to use uh, the previous question papers for each and every topic. We're going to answer a question from the previous question papers, right? Okay. Um, our first topic that we're going to do here is the accounting equation. Accounting equation. In our accounting equation, we're going to to explain what is accounting, what is accounting all about, right? Why do we need accountants? Right. Most of our students, this is their first time doing accounting. They'll be like, oh, I'm blank. I don't know what is accounting. So please feel free. Do not worry about that. We know that some of our students, it's their first time. So we just treat you all as if you've never done accounting before. So we have to tell you what is accounting. Okay, what is accounting all about? So from the accounting equation, we're going to journals. Journals, these are our books. Of first entry books of first entry so the first book that you're going to record in accounting is called a journal so we're going to have a, a, a video for accounting question we're going to have a video for for the journals then after the journals we're going to the general ledger in the general ledger I think some have heard about the T accounts right so this is where we'll be explaining to you what is debit what is credit yes in the accounting equation we're just going to tackle a bit of what is debit and what is credit but we're going to explain it more in detail in the general ledger after the general ledger we're going to teach you the bank reconciliation the bank reconciliation by this time you know the journals you know how many journals do we have you know which transactions goes to which journal then you are receiving cash you're paying out cash. The bank is receiving cash. The bank is paying out. But the bank is the bank statement is showing you an amount that is different from what you have in your cash box. So you need to pay repair what? A bank reconciliation to see what went wrong. Okay. After the bank reconciliation, we're going to pre to prepare a statement of profit or loss. A statement of profit or loss and other comprehensive income. In this statement, we want to calculate whether the business is making profit or the business is making loss. This is a statement that you should know by hand. At the time we go to the exam center, you should know how to prepare this statement. You need to see whether the business is making profit or the business is making loss. Then from here, I'm going to teach you depreciation. Depreciation is a bit of a difficult topic, but we're going to tackle it in what? In detail. Please do not worry. I'm going to tell you what is depreciation. How do we calculate depreciation? The method that we have for calculating depreciation. Okay. Then after calculating depreciation, we're also going to do property plant and equipment. Property plant and equipment. And statement of financial position. Statement of financial position. Okay. Um, property plan and equipment. We're just going to do it together with the statement of what? With the statement of financial position. 
Then after, we're going to do our control accounts. Our control accounts. After the control accounts, we need to do non-profit organizations. The non-profit organizations. You know, non-profit organizations, we are looking at clubs, churches, you know. Uh, they have also activities that needs to be paid out, but how they're going to generate the what? Their income since it's a non-profit organization. Then after the non-profit organization, we're going to do incomplete, incomplete records. Incomplete records were saying that uh, probably there was fire in the building, right? If there was fire in the building, some of the documents were, were destroyed by fire. But we still need to pay tax. Right, so we need to calculate what is known as estimated profit, so that we can be able to calculate what to calculate tax. So we'll tackle that also in what in our incomplete records. So you find out that after this video, this introduction video, we're going to have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten additional videos, each video for each topic. Right, after we tackle the the concept, the principles in that topic, we also come and look for a question from the previous question papers. You see here we have bank reconciliation, we have membership, membership fees, trading statement, and income and expenditure. This is non-profit organizations. Not for property plan and equipment. This is property plan and equipment. Then there was what? Not for choice. So you see that out of those 10 videos, here they've only asked for one, two, Three. So in other words, what, are we, what am I trying to say? I'm trying to say that you should know all the topics because you never know which topics are going to be examined. right? So you need to know all of them so that by the time you go to the exam, you will be well equipped. Okay, thank you guys. I will see you in our first, in our first video when we are doing the, the accounting question.